The approaching winter storm has grocery stores packed with shoppers clearing shelves. Fox 56's Georgia MacArthur joins us now live at Kroger in Georgia. How are things looking there? Yes, Imani and Marvin, customers tell me they had to go to several grocery stores to find the groceries that they need for tomorrow and the days ahead. See, there's nothing on the shelves. I have been to three stores just trying to find a box of crackers. Sharon Searcy is filling up her shopping cart with items her family needs before the winter storm hits Lexington. I bought my orange juice, I got my cough syrup, my potatoes, my oatmeal, because my grandkids usually come on the weekends and they love the strawberry and cream oatmeal. Living in Kentucky for the past 60 years, she says, despite the difficulty in the past with snowstorms, she doesn't mind taking a trip to go food shopping. I never have to worry about the groceries because I always have groceries. I feed everybody. So, you know, I stocked up on stuff that would make soup and chilies. Unfortunately, today was her day off. I thought I would just come out and do it before everyone else got off and decided to come out. With bare shelves across the states, stores are starting to see an increase in shoppers earlier ahead of the ice storm. I will say when we came here to the parking lot, like all the spots were filled. We were not expecting to see this many people. And experts say you want to be careful buying things like milk and mayonnaise, perishable items that without electricity can expire. Oh, so we actually had to go to EKU and like stay there for the entire weekend because our house didn't have electricity and stuff. And if you still need to head to the grocery store, you may want to head out now before conditions worsen. Live in Lexington, George MacArthur, Fox 56 News.